Hi guys, welcome back to Ivy's Kitchen. Today I am making this delicious dish called shakshuka, which is very popular for breakfast, but you can eat it for lunch or dinner. And it's so good and hearty. If you're interested in seeing how I do my version, keep on watching. Please subscribe and click on the bell. Please help spread the love for my channel by giving this video a like. All right, you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and start off by adding a little bit of olive oil and swirl that around the pan. For this olive oil, we're gonna go ahead and add our onions and I'm using about half a small onion. We wanna go ahead and sweat our onions, so I'm just gonna add a little bit of salt to it and this will help caramelize and soften your onion. And we're gonna continue cooking this until it softens. Go ahead and add your red bell peppers. I'm using half a bell pepper. And because I love heat, I'm adding a serrano pepper that I chopped up. And we're just gonna all let this cook together until it softens. That I'm gonna add the garlic. Okay, you guys, cause I wanna make this taste like we've been cooking this for a while. I'm gonna add about a tablespoon of tomato paste. And you want to toast your tomato paste before mixing it up with all the other ingredients. This will bring out the nice sweetness of it and take that metallic flavor away. And I'm going to coat all of the veggies with this tomato paste. And you can see that the veggies are starting to soften. And once the veggies are coated with that tomato paste, we're gonna add our fire roasted tomatoes that are diced. I went ahead and I got rid of the liquid in the can. While this is cooking, I wanna go ahead and season it with a little bit of salt. Not too much because it is already salted. Add some pepper. I love garlic, so I'm gonna add a little bit of garlic powder. That's probably not traditional. Let's go ahead and add a little bit of paprika. Say about half a teaspoon. And for some more smokiness, I'm adding about a quarter teaspoon of cumin. And I'm gonna cook this down until it becomes a thick sauce. All right, you guys, so this is the consistency that I want. If you want it a little bit more watery, you can add the juice from the can or water. Now I'm gonna go ahead and make a well so I can drop my eggs in here. My heat is on low. And we're just gonna drop our eggs in. You guys, it smells absolutely amazing. Can't wait to eat this. And there's the second egg. Now I have this on low because I don't want to overcook the eggs, so now I'm going to just cover it and wait for the eggs to cook. All right, you guys, to this, I'm going to go ahead and add some cilantro, or you can add parsley, whatever. And I'm gonna crumble some delicious feta cheese. Oh my gosh, you guys, this looks so amazing. I'm so excited to eat it. All right, you guys, now it's time to taste it. I'm so excited. And I don't know if you can see it, but there's some delicious yolk just running down. Mmm. Mmm. You guys, this is so flavorful. It's very smoky and spicy get the creaminess from the yolk and I love how the tomatoes taste like it's been roasting in the oven or over the fire mmm this dish is so amazing you could also make this dish for lunch or dinner anyways thank you guys for watching please don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe giving this video a like will help distribute this video throughout my YouTube and I will see you on the next video bye one more bite so good thank you guys for watching please don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon so you are notified each time i post a new video